I'm here with Pastor Kyle uh, Baldwin and his wife Liz in the Hearst Seventh-day Adventist Church in the Fort Worth area. And I, you have a lot of ministries happening here, but particularly you have a homeless ministry. Tell us a little bit about that. We have been doing this for several years. Uh, many years ago, we had one of our, our elders had a burden to reach out to the community and they just took it upon themselves. And you know, you've heard that saying, when you build it, they will come. And that's what happened. <laughs> they built it, people came. And now it's a, a ministry that can, has been going on for years. We go out twice a month go out to the Fort Worth homeless community and they give them uh, not only sack lunches, which they make, uh, but they also put glow tracks inside the, the, the bags and they like to talk to them and pray with them as they can. And so it's it's been a real blessing. There's people that are very much dedicated to this and we have actually people that come to our church just for this Sabbath from other mm. churches so they can be a part of this. Amen. So it's, it's exciting and we're just so glad the Lord is blessed. Uh -huh. Amen. And so when you go out, are you going to shelters? Are you going under bridges? Are you going to parks? Where do you we go typically down to the connect Lancaster with them? area of Fort Worth and we okay. go down to the missions in that area. We find people on the streets. We talk to them. We give them the sack lunches if they want them. If they, if they want water, we give them that. Sometimes if it's a hot day, they want the water more than the lunches. Mm -hmm. But we give them that. Then we'll give them the glow tracks. And if we have an opportunity to pray with them, we'll pull them aside and just ask them how they're doing and, and pray and just share the Lord with them as much as we can. And we try to build relationships. And we've had people that have been doing this for so long that they have built up relationships with the people that they see down in that area. Mm -hmm. And so it's just been an ongoing ministry. And I know that there's even young people that we have here uh, that are involved that come just for this as well. And they look forward to it. And so it's really been not only a blessing to the community, but it's a blessing to the church members as they feel they can be a part of something and they can share in this way. Amen. Amen. Anything you want to add to that, Liz? Well, it's just it's been such a blessing to our church. We've actually been able to bring some of them here to church. We build relationships with them. We meet them. We can invite them to church and they've come. And it's been good to share the Lord with those. Amen. Amen. Someday you might start a part uh, a a new church uh, congregation out there in the park or wherever. There you go. There you okay, go. God bless you folks. Thank you.